Magical souls and welcome back to another abundant video for you guys. So I got this beautiful downloaded ritual from Goddess Nyx last night and it's so beautiful for the full moon guys with these beautiful magical holidays that are ending. It's all about releasing the death and everything and beyond all of those things guys a lot of us have been going through our own personal troubles, struggles and all of those sad things. So we just need to release all the sorrow and grief of the fires, of all the tragedies and things that have happened and with the closing and ending of the season with Samhain and all of those good things guys we want to manifest abundance and create the things that we want to set in motion to accomplish for the end of the year slash creating things and what we want to accomplish for the new beginning of 2020 so with this beautiful ritual guys let's get into it i want to give you guys all good beautiful blessings so much and also before you guys get into this ritual i want to make a little disclaimer that this isn't going to instantly take away your sorrow and grief you guys need to do work preparing for this and towards my sincere condolences but you guys want to heal a lot and when it's the final little um when there's a little bit of your flame left that needs to be diminished is when it's appropriate to use this ritual so beforehand cleansing yourself with a nice beautiful sea salt bath you guys can ground yourself in mother earth in the grass the sea the lake the earth putting your feet in the dirt just regrounding yourself connecting releasing transmuting your energy into positive light and just working on yourself and when it's finally that time guys which i feel it's appropriate with goddess nyx she's wanted me to make this ritual for you guys it's very appropriate to do this ritual right now because it's the ending of the season of sorrow and grief and death and we're about to welcome in winter and start the new year so without further ado let me give you guys a beautiful nice little smudge by earth by air by fire by water by spirit in the name of goddess Nyx. may the beautiful souls that watch this video be blessed cleansed and rejuvenated through earth through air through fire through water through spirit through your beautiful elements of creation may earth mother geo be present with us and bless all those who watch as well as you goddess Nyx, kelowna embrace the black bull and all beings of love and light the divine god and all the ascended masters so mote it be so much love and light your guys' way. Let's get my incense going a little bit nicer and then we'll start this ritual up. From Nyx's groves to earth, may the power of the full moon bless my wand in this blessed time and space, so mote it be. Earth, air, fire, water, spirit, sacred elements of Nyx's creation ignite bright. I cast a protective circle around me in this time and space. No negative energy or evil can enter trace. Archangel Michael, Uriel, Gabriel, Raphael, and Metron, beautiful archangels of the five directions, please be present with me in this blessed time to create my magic enhance my power and intuition. May all those who watch this video be blessed and gain benefits through this ritual, so mode it be. So let's get into this ritual, guys. It's very beautiful, so... Of course, like you know, it's called Banishing Grief and Sorrow. To start it off, it's to the leaves, to the trees of the great divine, amongst the beauty where chaos is vanquished. All the love that flows freely will now bless me with its presence. Next, beautiful goddess of the night, Breathe me in with your beautiful wings of serenity. May I be filled with your divine love and finally release all that I must. May this low energy of mine be transformed into the most positive reflection of you and I across the lines of time. May all beings radiate pure divine peace, so mote it be. Earth, to the earth of creation where love once bloomed to create you, may your sacred divine love that prospered amongst the ages bless me in healing my own inner sorrow and grief. May I be free in your bliss. Air, across the lines of time, air, I call you from your sacred corner of where you dwell. May you sweep any lingering, low, staggering energy away from me. Fire, to the divine fires of the heavens that gleam brightly, bring forth pure light into me. May all that is good in the universe wash me clean and clear. 
water, a land of water, so pure amongst various ages. Wash me in your many waves of abundance. May these waves, one by one, bring my abundant thoughts into motion with this upcoming new moon phase. So once we get to this element of water part, guys, you want to start thinking of those abundant positive thoughts because we're shedding a lot of layers right now and now it's starting to transition into positive happiness. So what do we want to manifest before the end of the year slash what do we want to manifest and have those beautiful affirmations created for the new year? What do we want to conquer in the new year? What do we want to finish in this year? So let's go ahead and start thinking of those beautiful thoughts to manifest and let them come into fruition. I'm going to rewind to that part if you guys heard that big boom. I was manifesting some thoughts and that was like a big confirmation from the other side like what huge boom where'd the noise come from right spirit in this life we are a pure energy of the divine may our many mass fade away to the bottomless sea transmuted to pure light spirit breathe a fresh healed start for us into motion now may we breathe freely in divine peace so mode it be that is the conclusion of this beautiful ritual, guys. So while you have your beautiful sacred space cast, you can meditate, connect with Nyx, goddess of the night, Kelowna, Ambrose, the black bull, the beautiful aspects of God, the ascended masters. Just connect and do your magic and use your intuition, guys. Let it grow, let it prosper, and create all the beautiful magic that you need. And yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and turn on the post notifications down below. And out of one of my favorite past lifetimes, I'm so excited guys the house of night is gonna be created into a tv show i really hope they get the cast right because it holds a special place in my heart that beautiful world but anyways be sure to check out my bookstagram account if you guys want some fun things that are a little bit magical but more in the fictional world go ahead and check out my bookstagram account and why is my instant not really burning <laughs> it's not really burning and i actually did have a rough draft guys before I do my um, rituals for you. When I download them, I write it on scratch paper and just get the channeled message out and then I go ahead and transfer it to my little book of shadows. So one thing I always forget to do is actually not throw away this piece of paper because it's so powerful. So with the intentions that I've set and everything, I'm gonna go ahead and burn this paper as one final declaration, channeling that elemental magic power to bring what I wish into fruition. So by earth, by air, by fire, by water, by spirit. May my wishes that I have cast be set into motion. May my intentions and the magic of this ritual be done. So mode it be. The fire is literally touching my finger. I have to put it down, guys. <laughs> but it's hard to burn it good. You want to just make sure you crease your paper really good and just let this baby burn, burn, burn. So beautiful elements bless my spell to be complete. So mode it be. So just going to go ahead and let it do its thing. And yeah, guys, that's another thing I forgot to always mention to you in these rituals. When you do um, write them down, of course, write a beautiful copy in your book of shadows. But if you so wish, you can also write it on the scrap piece of paper first, like getting the gifs of it down and just like kind of reciting it. Then you can just go ahead, fold it up and burn it and let your magic just do its thing. So I feel really blessed and Thank you, Goddess Nyx, for this beautiful ritual. It's so beautiful, releasing all the grief and sorrow from ourselves that we no longer need to carry. It's going to be a beautiful new year, guys. It's time to release and start anew. And I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Like always, through the power of the full moon, from Nyx, from God, and all the beautiful aspects of Him, through Earth, through air, through fire, through water, through spirit, in the name of Goddess Nyx, may all of those of you who watch be blessed and rejuvenated in her loving embrace. So mote it be. I also open my circle to those of you who are watching this sacred video, but in this present time, I still have my circle cast so I can go ahead and create my magic.